When I was babysitting one time, I was babysitting, and there was a clock like that. But wooden? It was a huge wooden clock. Yeah, my grandma had And I was one. watching a fucking movie. And the, 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 the weirdest thing, first of all, I shouldn't have been babysitting, but they knew me, they knew my family, and the kids were already in bed. They just needed somebody to be down there in case the house caught on fire. Just don't let them die. I didn't even meet the kids. <laughs> I'm fucking, I'm down there in this Easy huge kid. house in Connecticut. I was a young man in Connecticut. And it's one of those houses that was built probably at the turn of the century. Like creepy. Definitely a slave owner, yeah. You know, when you step, an eerie. And the the weird thing was that the father, uh, i never forget, just a, a tall, kind of severe looking man, said, uh, if, if you would restrict yourself to the kitchen and to the study, we would appreciate it. And Yikes. I went, oof, okay, I'm not going to go through your shit. Yeah. So, um... <clears throat> There's this fucking uh, grinning clown, a giant grinning what? clown next to the clock. That's I mean, and it's big. as it's um, life size. It's, it's a little six, bigger six. than a human being. And it, it had it was grinning and it was very scary. It looked like an old carnival clown. Yikes. And it was uh, not a, it, was, it was like with legs and it was just all it was just like it looked real. And, uh, and, and I remember looking at it going, whoever bought that probably spent $10,000 on it because it's, it's the, the detail. An artist sketched it. It looks so fucking real. So I am freaking out over this crown. I'm not fucking, I'm, I'm, it had glass eyes. I'm watching the TV and I, I go, I don't out. want this thing to be looking no, at me. No. So I took the cover from the couch and I put it over the clown's head. And I was like, this That's is almost scary. It, well, I know that was even scarier because yeah. now I got just the thing's legs and it's covered. So I'm like, this is <laughs> freaky, man. So I go, uh, but I'm not going to be a pussy. I'm going to watch TV. So I go to the kitchen and um, one of the kids comes down and says, I have a headache. So I go, okay. Um, I give him some water. And I walk him up back upstairs, put him in bed. And I call the dad, you know, and I call the mom. I call the dad. I, and, and I said, um, I, they were actually, by the way, this is before cell phones. So they were at a, a club. So I called the club. The father gets on. And I said, um, I just so you know, uh, Peter has a headache. I gave him some water. I just want to let you know that. And, uh, oh, by the way, I put a, 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 a freaking blanket sheet. over yeah, the clown. Over the clown, yeah. And uh, he said, what clown? <laughs> You're making this story And up. I went, the grinning you're just, clown. You're trying to make this story good? TV. It's so bad. And he goes, we don't have a clown. Take the kids. Get them Run. out of here. Get out of here. They've been seeing a clown in their dreams every night. Get out of I here. I ran into the study. There was just a sheet on the ground. The clown was not there anymore. I grabbed hey, the children. Hey, at what point did you bail on the story? <laughs> At what point? Because I was like, man, this is getting weird. Where's he going with this? Unless he, something was really haunted. The clown. I knew you were going to go there. Was. And luckily, I wheel kicked it. I knew I it. I killed it. I knew you were going to go there. I took the kids and I got Did any of you guys see Ronda Rousey's performance? No. I didn't see it, but I, the, like uh, the like a lot of the Below the Belt production team, a lot of the, the, the my show around those guys, mm -hmm. they're so into WrestleMania. And online, the ratings have been. I guess she killed it. I guess she, she just. She supposedly did. Really, I, I guess really she did awesome. really, really Good. well. Yeah. And then after that, I she even did an interview going. You know what? I'm actually happy about my UFC losses because it led me to here. It's actually for the better. Good. So she's Good owning her, it, man. man. Yeah, it's the best case scenario. Fuck yeah. That's her carrying Triple H. I, I saw a highlight Damn. of it and it looked strong. like she was doing really well. Triple H is a big boy, isn't he? Yes. Yeah, apparently she hit a home run. I don't know. I don't know good what that means in the wrestling world, but apparently she hit good a home run. Good for her. Yeah, good for her. Brock Lesnar. So he signed a deal with W. He re-signed with WWE, but there's a clause saying he can have one fight in the UFC. Yeah, this is what I was saying on Below the Belt yesterday while I was filming. <clears throat> this is one of our topics, and I mm -hmm. said everyone's freaking out. Oh, they needed Brock. Brock's done. Well, well, no. You can do both. It's not an exclusive deal. Yeah. So they have one giant fight. I'm hoping it's John Jones. That'd be an interesting fight, huh? I think for, I think for Brock, it's either John Jones would be a terrible matchup for him, so I don't know if Brock would do it. Why? Or Brock would just get his face. He hasn't fought. Pummeled. John would just take him down and beat the shit out of him. Take him down? Yeah, take him down. Really? Yeah, he'd take him down. He'd, he'd keep distance for a long time and pick him apart on the feet huh. and then take him down. Trip wow. him. That's what I wow. think he'd do. Oh, trip him, huh? Yeah. Okay. 
Um, mm. But so I don't think Brock's going to take that fight. I see Brock versus Francis and Ghana. That's an interesting thing because they swing for the fences, but then Brock would just tackle him, get him on the ground. Yeah, but it's this big head. kind of you know, can Brock get him down? Can Francis land a punch? You know, the whoever Giants. does the lands first, it's over. Mm. As far as if there's a takedown, he's screwed. If Brock gets hit, he's screwed. And yep. you could that post would be sick. Yep, it's a good fight for Brock. You know, so it's, a, it's a, almost a safer fight than Mark Hunt. Brock Lesnar. Mark Look Hunt has to, talk about know, a Viking. Mark Hunt has good, freak. you know, takedown defense and is, you know, very experienced. Francis, a, show us Brock Lesnar in high school wrestling. Look at how big he was there. Looks exactly the same. Yeah, and he was just r- ridiculous. He's one of the biggest freaks of our lifetime, man. Is that it right there? Oh high yeah, high school. You could barely see. There he is. Look at him. That neck. Kids are like Jesus, bro. Good I know. God, he was huge. Hey, look at him in college. College is stupid. No, college. Is that college then? Yeah, that's college. In Won Minnesota. the NCAA's. Look at him. People he, he actually got beat by that that Neil guy. Who, uh, never played football. He's like, you know what? Let me go be the starting left guard for the New England Patriots. And he did it. I'm a Brock fan, man. I'm not a fan of that haircut, but I'm a Brock mm-hmm. fan. He looked really innocent. High school. He's thick and as strong as it gets. Good luck being Dude, I've, I've kind of forgot about your Invisalign. How's it feeling? Let me see your teeth. It's coming together. Are they? or are nope. they, They're not really coming together. <laughs> Doing nothing. Uh, nothing. <laughs> but I'm only on my second tray, bro. Give it, give it some time. Did they start tightening it up as it pass, time passes? Apparently. You know, you know it's working because it's doing... But what if they got it Is wrong? Is it working? What if they got it wrong? We'll know soon. I got... This is my second tray. I got. I've only got twelve more to go. Go, go, go. You wear them once a week. Program. Yeah, every week you change. Every ten days. And you go in. Can't wait for it to be done. Really? But I do like chewing on my, on the rubber. Why why not? Why not just get veneers? They're nice. Veneers veneers don't straighten your teeth. Veneers just make your teeth white, and my teeth are pretty white. Yeah. In what fucking world are your teeth white? (laughs) Listen, don't go In like this. Don't go like, don't go like, your teeth don't white. like pull back your head. Don't well, go huh? like you acted like you just saw like uh, a bunch of decapitated heads. Don't go huh? like that. Don't ever do that again. In my w- teeth are and people are 50 when I do my stand up, they go, let me see your teeth, bro. And I go, and they go, it's they're not that bad. Because like, right I know because Shab is a bad person. Yeah, your teeth are 50 shades of yellow. 